सो हेलो डे स्टूडेंट वेलकम बैक टू दिस यूट्यूब चैनल सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर जस्ट गोइंग टू कवर द यूनिट टू ऑफ द प्रोफेशनल कम्युनिकेशन टॉपिक एंड दीज आर द एम सी क्यू क्वेश्चन डैट यू नीड टू कंसिडर जस्ट बिफोर गोइंग टू एनी कम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम और द एग्जाम इन विच दिस प्रोफेशनल कम्युनिकेशन पार्ट इज कमिंग सो दिस माइट बी ऑफ द डिफरेंट नेम इन योर यूनिवर्सिटी और इन योर स्कूल एंड दैट मे बी इन अ डिफरेंट यूनिट इन योर स्कूल बट दिस टॉपिक इज ऑफ like the types of the communication and the medium by which it travel so starting uh, from the question number 1 so on the basis of the mutual uh, participation communication is of how many type so 2 3 4 and 5 the communication are of how many types on the basis of mutual participation so the communication is of two types on the basis of mutual participation what are those uh, if you know just comment down in the comment section or i am just telling uh, in a next slide so on the basis of the nature communicate uh, communicating can be of two types so communicating uh, means uh, i think is there should be a communication communication be of two types so it's true or false so on the basis of nature the communication is of two types it's true and of the question number 1 it is also two types so those are like uh, on the basis of like uh, mutual participation so it is of two types one way communication or two way communication like suppose you are sitting in a auditorium and the speaker is saying something just uh, suppose that you are sitting in a sandeep maheshwari video uh, and in the front of him and just you are listening to him so that is a one way communication uh, if it uh, if he is in a seminar but if he is uh, in uh, he is in a like uh, your school or something in your class so you can ask uh, any question from him that is a two way communication like uh, in the same person the same person uh, if he is speaking in a auditorium that is one way communication if that person is speaking in your class that is two way communication like you can also ask something and he can also explain something so on the basis of the nature communication so it, uh, it how what are those type like the basic of the nature so it is formal and informal like uh, the nature of the communication can be formal and it can be informal so what are the types of the formal communication like what are the things that is needed to be a formal communication and informal communication if you can just make a note in a comment section so uh, this will make you uh, revise all the things that uh, are important for your exams are uh, important for your topic to understand the topic better so if you haven't understand thing just go to the video section or my video uh, you can see all this thing in an organization which of this uh, is not a type of communication so downward upward curve and horizontal so which one is not a type of communication curve curve is not any type of communication in any organization so one way communication is the most democratic way of the communication no it's false like two way communication is the most democratic way of the communication like if the government is taking any changes just uh, he have to take the feedback of the public if uh, the government is not taking the feedback of the public that means it's a di dictatorship like a dictatorship rule like a king rule he don't want to think that what his person or the person living in the country think about so it's not a democratic so it's false so next question is communication is a dictator type communication so which communication is a dictator so i have explained earlier like one way communication is a dictator type communication so moving next any business house is concerned with dash communication so of question number 6 the options are external dumb deaf and blind so of question number 6 is external communication there are two types of the any business communication which is con concerned like external communication and the internal communication what the uh, customer what the Uh, any consumer is getting the feedback is known as the external communication and the internal communication how the employees react on the things that uh, the things uh, policies which are getting changed in a uh, organization or any business that is internal communication so next is any business house is concerned i think this question is repeated so next question dash communication flows from a superior to the subordinate like uh, if any information is with the superior and it is going to the subordinate like uh, there is a one superior here and it is going to the all the subordinate and then after that it is also going to the subordinate so it's type of a downward communication like any information from up to going down so of question number 7 option number b is the correct answer so now question number 8 which of this is not a limitation of the downward communication so the things are under communication over communication car communication and distortion so like uh, is a limitation if you talk about the limitation of the downward communication there is a under communication 
there is a over communication there is a distortion so car communication is not the limit of the downward communication suppose uh, if a manager tells anything to uh, his employees like if it is uh, this information going downward sometimes it's uh, under communication sometimes the things got missed in the uh, way sometimes it's uh, like over communications uh, the a the things a is explained by the manager and if it reaches to the ground level it becomes like b or something else that is not told by the manager so that is over communication and distortion so next question which of these moves from the grassroots level so what are the things that are most on grassroots level suppose it's a grass and it's at a root so the things that are going from down to up is known as upward communication of question number nine option c is the correct answer so last question which of these is not a method of the upward communication so what are the things that is not a method of the upward communication like a scolding suppose uh, the person uh, manager wants to take a feedback from uh, their employees so he must be open uh, use the open door policy like uh, he is expecting all the things uh, all the feedback from their employee or the complaint he is also expecting the complaint or the suggestion boxes but a scolding is not the way of the upward communication so hope you understand all the things that i have explained in this topic and unit 1 and unit 3 all the, all the units are uploaded on my video uh, section of my channel so you can just visit to uh, this and i am just leaving with a question that you are just going to comment down in the comment section so the question is uh, in a, any organization or any any business what type of the communication is the most famous communication and it as the uh, known as the effective way of the communication and your options are yes, listen carefully like uh, the first option is upward communication second is downward communication third one is curve communication and the fourth one is horizontal communication so just think on this thing uh, which type of communication is more in the any organization or any business and comment it down so see you in the next video with a new unit and uh, some more new mcqs so till then take care and bye bye